What's up everyone? If you are here, chances are you need to remove Google Authenticator from your Binance account, right? Don't worry, you are in the right place. Whether you are switching phones, moving to a new Authenticator app, if you lost access to your Authenticator app or you just need a reset, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. Now, give this video a thumbs up and let's get started. Let's say you want to sign into your Binance account, but you no longer have access to your Authenticator app. Okay, let me launch my Binance app. And I will tap on sign up slash login. So my email is already saved. I'll tap on next. So now I'm being asked to input my password. So now let me input my password. Then I'll tap on next. So, as it says, Authenticator App Verification, enter the six-digit code generated by the Authenticator App. So, let's assume I no longer have access to the Authenticator App. So, all I have to do is to tap on this security verification unavailable or switch to another verification method. If I tap on switch to another verification method, it will allow me to use either email or phone number. So, if your account has email, you can use email. If it has phone, you can use your phone number. So. In order to remove or reset the authenticator, all you have to do is to choose this option here, security verification unavailable, which is what I'm going to choose right now. So I'll tap on security verification unavailable. So you pay attention to the next page. So the next page here said select unavailable methods. Please select all security methods that are unavailable and you will like and you would like to reset. Okay. You don't have to select email because if if you have your email and you still know your email password is available so don't select email and here phone number if your phone number is have access to your phone number you don't have to select it so the only thing you have to select is authenticator authenticator app as you can see you just have to select it that the app is unavailable and then tap on confirm reset so when you tap on confirm reset now they will see are you sure you want to reset your security method so in order to protect your account withdrawal Drawers P2P selling and payment service will be disabled for 48 hours. Only do this when you are not planning to do any transaction within two to three days, as you can see. So I'll not be proceeding because I don't want to disable my P2P, so I'll have to cancel. So if you are currently signed in and you wish to remove or reset your Google Authenticator app, all you have to do is to tap on this small button here, more, tap on it. And then scroll down and look for security here is security then tap on it now let's wait for the next page to load mm -hmm. so as you can see the authenticator app is showing green tick which means it's enabled so i have to tap on authenticator app so now if you want to change to another authenticator app you use this edit button if you wish to remove or delete or reset use this delete button delete icon here i mean so now let me show you what is going to say let me tap on this one now so as you can see it's saying are you sure you want to change the certificate app verification withdrawals and p2p will be disabled for 24 hours after changing the certificate app to ensure safety of your asset so if you just wish to change to another authenticator, tap on continue so but in this video i'll be tapping on remove because i wish to remove so let me tap on this so as you can see, are you sure you want to remove the ticketer app verification? Withdrawal and P2P transaction will be disabled for 24 hours. Just see the same warning, just like Bybit. So after reading all these, two security factor methods are required for withdrawal and other actions. Using only one verification method will put your account at greater risk. So I'll just have to tap on continue. So it will take me back to this step. Okay, the ticketer app verification. Enter the CD. So I no longer have access to the authenticator. All I have to do is to security verification. Tap on this. And then in the next page, I'll be asked to select unavailable method. So I have to select that my authenticator is unavailable. Just have to select. And then I'll tap on confirm reset. 
so that is it are you sure you want to reset your security method in order to process i'll just tap continue continue so in the next page i'll be asked to choose or bypass this verification one is either i use the email verification to reset the authenticator or i use the phone number whichever one you choose just verify any of these so right now a code will be sent to my email once i get the code and enter it and submit the google authenticator will be removed from my finance account and there you have it you have successfully removed google authenticator from your binance account it is easy right now don't forget to set up a new two-factor authenticator method to keep your account safe and secure if this video helped you out make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more easy step-by-step -step tutorials if you have any question or you're running into any issues drop a comment below i'm here to help thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one